Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. It's time to go boo hunting! Yes, boo hunting. Uh, to get into the bathroom, we are going to need to find five boos to get into it. So, we're going to have to go back to some older cleared rooms and collect some boos. Now, look at that light on the uh, Game Boy Horror down there at the bottom right corner there. You'll notice that it's blue, but when you enter a room that has a boo in it, it'll turn yellow. So, then you got to search around this room and it'll turn red when you're close. Whoa, 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 I seen something. Whoa, pocket change! That wasn't here the first time I was in this room, remember? But here we go! Oh, it's a boo bomb. Um, that's sort of like a prank the boos play on you, uh, if you ever get a boo bomb, just run, because it's gonna hurt you. I think it only does five points of damage, though. Eh, yeah, poison mushroom. Hello there. Hello there. Okay, when, uh, it's bamboo. Um, whenever you see a boo, or I should say, whenever you expect a boo that's gonna come, expect the boo to come out, immediately start vacuuming in the center of the room if you can. You can't lock on or hold on to the boos like you can most other ghosts. In fact, they will actually run to other rooms if you fail to catch them on the first try. And believe me, the stronger and the more... The, the, yeah, excuse me, the boos that have more HP will definitely make a uh, run for other rooms uh, in later areas. But we'll get to that when I get to that. Um, ooh, I see a boo, or possibly... Here we go! Hey, you just- you- what? You're, you're not allowed to phase into me like that! That's not fair! And, uh, yeah, I got it! He almost escaped to the other room. Um, if a boo ever does escape, pay attention to which wall they phase through, and what'll happen is they'll actually go into the room on your map. So, like, if it went to that left room, you would just simply have to go to that door uh, to your left here to find the boo. And there's another boo in this room, of course. Uh, you'll only find boos in cleared rooms. Um, it's flashing closer to... Well, what the heck? Shoe rack? What about you? No? Um, nothing? Well, where the heck is it flashing, then? Is it like this? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, th that's a boo ball. That's another prank. Um, this thing is completely useless. You can, you can grab it like that and then release it to fling it, and that's all it does. And here we go. Come on, baby! Oh, wait, wait, no, you didn't appear in the middle? That's not fair! You're, they're not, they always seem to appear in the middle. Oh, there we go. That's another boo. Uh, as you can see, these are pretty easy to clear out quickly. And then you just click through the save menu there. I'm pretty sure this leads to the balcony. There isn't any boos over here. Um, what's cool about when you collect a boo, or suck up a boo, I should say, into your poltergust, you will get uh, a save prompt. So every time you get a boo, you'll be able to save your game. You save your game. That's a great way to save your game if there aren't any toads nearby. Alright, now that that's cleared, I'm going to be going to those other rooms down the hallway here and see what other poltergeists we can expect to find. Oh, like this boo in this room somewhere. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, it's a bomb. And... Wait, is there anything in these bookshelves this time again? I just... I'm, I know there's something in these bookshelves. And I know I didn't shake these things before. Come on. I know they dropped some stuff. Unless I already did shake them and they, I got their contents. I don't know. Let's shake the chandelier. Oh, the chandelier's got something. Okay. Desk again. And there's a boo! It's Taboo! <laughs> yeah, they all have names so you can tell them apart. Oh, no, no, no! Don't you dare go into that other room. And that's number four. If I'm not mistaken, you can get, like, seven or eight boos in Area 1. Um... But don't, like, go out of your way to make sure you get all the boos you possibly can in the chapters, because you can always get a boo on any chapter, basically. Uh, so you, there's no, like, uh, worries about ever missing one. You just have to go back to the room that had it, uh, if it ever should hide again. Like, if you take too long to find it, or you leave the area that you're in, and it's boo-licious, and uh, maybe it's booty-licious, I don't know. 
if you ever take too long, it'll hide again uh, in the room that it went to, like if it faced through a wall, or if you leave the area completely, it'll go back to the room that it was at before. And uh, now he'll say that I got five booze, and uh, he's saying to go to the washroom because it's now open. This was the room that I said was locked before, which I refer to as the bathroom, but I guess it's called the washroom. Same difference. And is there a boo in here? Ooh, I think there is. Yeah, this is the nursery where we fought Chauncey. Oh yeah, baby! Turbo! Oh no! Yeah, come on, give me! Yeah! That's number six. And I believe I cleared out the entire area now. So what I'm going to be go uh, doing now is returning back to the first floor and uh, clearing out the rooms I was already at before, and then going to the washroom. Uh, I, I just want to get the booze out of the way uh, early on, basically. Uh, just to keep it all nice and organized, like, th th to take on every room as I go, so to speak. Alright, this, this area is still not cleared, as you can see. So I'm going to go into this room. By the way, that hallway will not be cleared until Area 3, no matter what you do. So uh, don't even bother. Okay, there's a boo in here. It could be anywhere. It could even be behind you. Wait, wait. Portrait. Come on, baby. No, it's a bomb. No, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> Oh, wait, I see some chairs. Uh, whenever you see a boo pop out, or a boo is going to pop out, it's boo la la. Um, you'll notice that, that it'll be it'll make like a little light effect, the circular light effect from where it used to be, or from where it is, excuse me, and then it'll rush to the center of the room. Well, most of the time. And there should be one more boo in the storage room, if I'm not mistaken, yes. And then I'm gonna go over to that area with the bathroom. Hello there! Game Boo! Oh no! I don't want to play you! But I do want to suck you into my vacuum for treasure later! Mountains of treasure! Seriously, you definitely want to get all the booze if you want to get an A rank. Alright, next room. Here we go. Well, I shouldn't say this isn't the next room just yet. I, yet. I still have to go down the hallway. And there we go. And down over here you'll find the washroom, but I'm gonna go first back, well, avoid the ghost mice. Oh, this this guy, um, he is uh, another portrait ghost that I'm gonna get into later. Um, you need f the fire element to get him, let's just say that, so I can't do anything about that right now. Anyway, this is the bathroom, so I guess the other one is a washroom and this is the bathroom. Is it? Oh, there's no uh, booze in here, I guess? Um, okay, I guess I'm not complaining. Though it would be nice to knock off some more booze as I go. I got eight booze already, so, uh, um, if you shake this toilet over here, it'll give you a key. Ew. 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 Uh, I, I need some bleach. And preferably some hand sanitizer. Um, the only thing that you need to do to clear this room is to cheer up Toad over there. So, ooh, money! Woohoo! In the medicine chest! And there's some money in that chandelier up there, I guess. Uh, you can also pull off this piece of toilet paper here if you want to, to clear up, to clean up the room a little bit, shake that picture frame, and as well as the sink. Man, this place is dusty! It's a good thing I have a vacuum. And, uh, yeah. So I guess uh, he plopped it in the toilet. Ah. Uh, I love this phrase here. I'll just flush that old worry away. Yep, I'll just let it swirl down to the depths and let happiness refill my life. He <laughs> just described the functions of a toilet there. Okay, that key is for um, the fortune teller's room, which is down the hall here. Uh, see that at the bottom right corner of the map? Uh, I'll give you another look at that. Right. Well, never mind. I'll I know where I'm going. You'll know where I'm going as I go there. I'm being overly descriptive here. <laughs> So, let's walk down this hall, oh, to just avoid these bowler ghosts like that, uh, just let them throw a ball towards one side and then dodge to the other. They'll always throw it to where you are and not where you're going, basically. And those other uh, ghosts that drop bombs, I believe are called bomb danglers or something like that, if I'm not mistaken. I'll just keep calling them all danglers, because you know me in names. I suck. Anyway, go into here, and... 
Uh, oh wait, there's a cheese mouse in here, if I'm not mistaken. Um, stand over here, get out your Game Boy ho Horror here, examine the cheese, return, now immediately go over to this side, point your vacuum to the floor, and get the mouse. Yeah, baby! Woohoo! Jackpot, baby! And there we go. Get as much of this loose pocket change as I can. Um, if you shine your light on this, uh, ball over here for a long enough time, you'll see another portrait ghost known as Madame Clairvoya. Um, she... I can't do anything about her right now, just like that butler that's roaming the hallways there. So, uh, I'm gonna ask her who she is, and she'll blah blah blah, blah blah blah, blah blah, boo boo doo boo, you know, stuff like that. You get the idea. And, uh, I'm supposed to find dropped items. There's five dropped items that I'm supposed to find. They're, they're Mario's items. And once I find all five, I'll, uh, I'll get the, be, to be able to progress as well as collect her as a ghost. This room is so annoying. The ghost in this room can only be seen when you look through the mirror. So, have your back towards the wall like this. And then, I should say, uh, face the wall like that. And have your back towards the mirror. And then when a ghost appears, turn around and shine the flashlight on them. There's two of them now. Uh, that other one's gonna get me, isn't it? No, 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 I don't think so. And there's another one. Well, this is actually going pretty dang smoothly. I'm surprised. Um, I believe this is where I'm gonna get the fire element as well. And there we go. Give me... Give me... There we go. And I just took a little damage there because he pulled me a little wildly. But I, I don't really care about damage as much as I do my coinage. You can also tell where the go uh, ghosts are appearing when you see that smoke, obviously. Then you're gonna get a treasure chest here. This contains the fire element. And there's also a boo in this room in, ca in case you can't tell. That thing is really, really bright in case you can't tell as well. In fact, it's so bright you can barely see any detail on that metal. Or at least maybe it's just just how it looks on my TV. So, uh, e Egad over here is gonna say it's a fire element metal, and now we're gonna be able to find fire element ghosts whenever you see certain torches. Um, there's three elemental uh, metals. One is fire, one is water, one is ice. Um, you can find water elementals anywhere there's water. Fire elementals, you have to find some uh, torches, like the one that's in this very room right here, like that right there. Um, you'll see that ghost that's floating up there. It looks like a potoboo. Uh, suck it into your vacuum, and you'll now have uh, the power of that ghost. Press the L button, and you'll be able to shoot fire. It's uh, trigger sensitive, so you can control how much power you have. If you snap the button in, you'll be able to shoot a blast of fire away from you. But that uses quite a lot of power. Anyway, uh, refill your thing here. Uh, all you have to do is shake that if no ghost will appear, and a ghost will appear. And that's pretty much all there is to the fire. Um, you can use that fire element to burn those fake doors so you never get fooled by them again. Um, you can also use them to light candles, which you need to do to get out of this room. Nope, I didn't I didn't want to suck the candles. I used the wrong uh, shoulder button, pardon me. Um, there we go. And there we go, door is now open. I want to get some more fire for the next next room with Madame Clara Boya here. Because I need to get, get a key in that room. Um, there's also a uh, ghost in here. I should say a boo, excuse me. And it's Kung Boo! He is going to use his karate skills to defeat me, but he kind of failed. Um, some boos attack you, some don't. Uh, I don't know all of them, you know, by heart, so whatever. If they attack you, they attack you. They don't do much damage. And as you can see, there's more uh, candles to light, just like the other rooms, so go ahead and light them. And a key will appear on top of one of those uh, pillars in, in the center of the room around Madame Clara, Clara Voya's fortune teller post thingy there. It should appear right over here. There we go. Gimme. Gimme. Give me. I want. There we go. Woo! And this should be the key to the dining room if I'm... No? No? Oh! oh okay, I know what it, I know why they're, they're leading me here. Okay, I can get a... Uh, portrait ghost down this hallway. You, you go away. Now I can get that butler. Um, his name is Shivers. Uh, I'm going to capture him. All I need to do is light his uh, light his uh, candles there, and he'll say run away. Even though he's carrying the candles, you know, he's saying to run away from them, but he's not dropping the candles. 
It makes no sense whatsoever. So anyway, you want he doesn't hurt you or anything right now. In fact, you can go right through him. Well, not go right through him or bump into him. He's going to walk down this way, but he's going to double back and then go back down to his room, which is down the hallway here. So what you want to do is take that key that you just got and follow him into the room that he's going into. Um, this is going to be the washroom. Um, I'm going to, I'm just going to skip this room for now. Oh, it's not the washroom, excuse me, it's the laundry room. And just go straight into this room so I can get uh, shivers here. This is the butler's room. Um, pretty much he is the only guy that you can take care of here. And he is a pretty annoying ghost, but he's also pretty silly. Anyway, all you have... I said... What? I, I was going to say, all you have to do is shine your light on him to uh, get him, but I, evidently I took too long there, so my mistake there, I now I have to go back and get him uh, again, so I have to light his torches again. Be right back! Alright guys, let's try this again. This time, hopefully with more success. Now what he's going to do is he's going to sit down onto this chair here, and then he's going to be vulnerable to the flashlight. Come on, come on. There we go, there we go! Let's suck this sucker in and get his pocket change. Man, these ghosts certainly like to carry a lot of pearls, I have to say. Come on, yes, I got his big pearl, because I got him down to 10 HP in one shot. Awesome! And now there's a, a boo in this room, of course. Uh, there's also a fire and elemental ghost there. I'm gonna open up this treasure chest, this will give me a key. Boop! Click, 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 click. And that will open up or I should say, uh, uh, unlock that door later. Um, there's a secret in this room, I should add, later on. Oh. Um, or I should say, there's a secret room attached to this room. Wait, actually, I can I can go in that room now, so I might as well show that now. But I first want to get the boo of this room, wherever the heck it is. Is it, is it here? The chair? Well, where the heck? It flashed red. This thing again? Oh, okay. Uh, Peekaboo, yay! You are gone! Whew! Cleared. Uh, I guess you can get a lot more booze than I thought you could in Area 2. My bad. Uh, maybe that's just what I got most of the time when I first played this game. But anyway, take out your Game Boy Horror and examine this mouse hole. It'll create a vortex. Go into this vortex and you'll end up in this room. This is the hidden room. Um... There is a Blackout exclusive blue ghost in this room here later on in Area 4, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to have to end, uh, come back here later. Uh, but, oh shoot, that's an Ice Elemental Ghost. Um, to hurt those, you have to first burn away their icy core with uh, your fire and then suck them in. Um, I would like to get you out of my way. There we go. I, I forgot where the blue ghost is, though. Oh, maybe it was in this chest, but I can get it later just by shaking it. Ooh, pocket change for the win! Um, so, yeah, I, I can't do anything about the, the blue ghost in here, even though I can access this room right now. But remember that there is a blue ghost in here, and that'll have to come back in here later, okay? Shake that. It's another ice elemental ghost. Just use your fire on it. You can also kill it. Well, I should say... Uh, de destroy it or something. It's hard to say kill a ghost, you know what I mean? Um, just by using your fire element on it, just by tapping the button. And uh, opening up this middle chest will uh, give you yet another one. And I would like to clear this room. There we go. And there should be a boo in this room as well. Uh, but as you've seen, I shook pretty much everything in this room and there wasn't the blue ghost. But don't worry, I'll be back here later. Come on. Anything in the chandelier? Anything? Please? Come on. Nothing? Uh, I'll just open this up. This will give me a load of cash. This, so this room is definitely worth uh, going into. And quickly click through these things as fast as you can and collect those jewels as fast as you can before they disappear as well as the rest of the cash. You want to try and get as much of it as you can. They give you one uh, jewel of each color, or I should say one basic jewel of each color. And did that rest of the cash already disappear? Oh, come on! Well, at least I got the main jewels of this area. Um, where is the red ghost? In here? I should, I should say the boo. It's a boo bomb. Right here? Come on. Yeah! Gumboo! I guess he is a gumball now, and he is going to be chewed up 
in my poltergust. And there we go. And let's... I believe that's all I can do in this room for now. Can I shake this goblet-like thing? Uh, yes, I can! Awesome. And that'll give me a gold bar. What about these candelabras here? What if I light them? Like, if I were to just, like, do one of these dealios. Will that get me anything? No, okay. Uh, there's another candelabra I might take care of. No? Okay. Um, examine this mouse hole to go back. Whoop! Like that. And now this is what I mean about burning fake doors. This door right here is a fake one, so I'm just gonna burn it right away. And once you burn it, it will never, ever come back. Um, like you can do that in the hallways and stuff like that, uh, that have those fake doors. Hello there! You are going to be put inside my vacuum for safekeeping. Oh man, I just realized I am really over the time limit here. I should say over what I wanted to do for a single part. So, I'm gonna end it here, and then when I get back on the next part, I'm gonna clear out this room. See you guys then!